Hello students, good morning. Uh, as of today, uh, we're going to complete uh, the tools of Google Sites. Last week we learned many things about it. How to add pages, uh, how to change the themes of our websites, okay, and we learned also how to add a YouTube video to our website. Okay, let's see what we're going to learn today. Our objective for today is to create a website using Google Sites. Okay, and our success criteria identify how to add links on text or a photo. Links to another website. For example, if you have a website, if you have a new website and you want to link it to a different website, how we can do that. Okay, the second one, identify how to add image, cursor, uh, and collapsible text and divider okay then we're going to design and publish the website okay let's start I'm going to uh, log into our account you log into your account please and you start editing your same previous website that we work on the Expo 2020 if you see here that I already create many pages, I hope so that you already do that. Create many pages. Uh, change your theme of your website like I did here. You need to more make sure that you change the theme of your website. Okay. As well, the things that we learn that we click publish in the end every time we already finish uh, adding something to be updated on the assignment or in the link of you publish it before because I can see your updates okay here we go what we're going to learn today see here and insert first you can do a uh, different layout as I, as I told you before just try it let me go to the mirror on, more info here then I'll add a different layout here for example I can select any one I like it this is uh, a layout that you can add it here what I can add in this layout look here guys you can press this button here plus you can upload an image or select an image from the for example from your uh, photos on your Google Drive if you have some or you can go to uh, Google search here or the photos here here I have some images that I added before in my Google Drive for example I need these pictures then I select click insert I already insert this image I can add another one and also I can add different things I can add a YouTube uh, video for example here as you know I can search for the things that I need for example here our title is Expo 2020 okay and I'm gonna search for some videos related to it okay you can select uh, any of these one here what is Expo 2020 I believe this is related to this page what is more info about Expo 2020 okay I add a video here what is Expo 2020 I can add more image here for example select an image from your Google Drive or you can upload it from anywhere okay then I click insert okay done here uh, the, the other things today also we're going to learn we know already how to add a layout let's go down here after the layout you'll find many things okay before I go down there is another thing that uh, the uh, the our first uh, success criteria today is how to add a link how to add a link for example this is a text that we added before if you remember I can highlight it okay and how I can add a link you see this one here this is like insert a link what kind of link you want to go to the home page if your website or go to the contact us uh, page no I want to get a link from outside and add it here how 
for example I have the main expo website here I can take this one I copy it the uh, the link of that website copy it and I go back to my website and paste it here right click and paste then I click apply now I already add what a link here whatever anybody visit my website click here it will take them to the website the main website of the expo okay guys this is how we add a link to a text okay let's see how to add a link to a photo for example I have a photo here this photo here how to add a link I click on that photo there is also insert link to another website or it takes me to the home page or expo news maybe I can put it that takes me to another page okay means when anybody click on this one it will take him to another page or if you want to link something related to the website if this uh, image here is related to what for it's a part or the the view of uh, expo how it's look like you can go here and select for example discover uh, for example uh, any uh, visiting uh, here uh, attractions some this page the attraction of Expo 2020 I can take this one highlight it and copy it and go back to my website let me change this one and delete the link and I add my link paste it and I click apply now it's already linked to another website okay guys we're going to check this link is working or not after I publish my website and I see my published site to check because here in preview if we click preview to see how our website look like it doesn't these links it will yes it works before it doesn't if you click here now it will take you to that website okay let's try also the image here click on it it takes me to the that page that we link it to now I understand what's mean links here okay let's cl close the preview if you want any time to check your website how it look like you click preview okay guys I already show you this before okay let me go to another page here for example Ex expo news nothing there Okay. The other part today, I ask you to on our six criteria. It is how to add an image course. Okay. It is what is image course? So we add image before. This is the different here that image rotating, like you add an image that people can rotate the image between the image that you add. Let's try it. I click on it. Then here is asking me to insert the images that you like to be added. It will not be one image. Should be more than one image. Okay. Then I click image, upload image, or select image from my Google Drive. I'm gonna select upload image. I will go where I save it in my computer. For example, I save it in this folder, it's called Google Drive, and I'll go to the some pictures that I save it here. I call that folder Expo Photos. You can create any folder and create in your computer and call it Expo Photos. For example, I select this one. Okay. It is going to upload it to my website. Let me add another one. Click upload image. This, for example, Oxford station, the metro station. You can add another one. This one, then I click open. Now I add three images. Then I click what? Insert. This cursor here, I can expand it as I want. Let's make the photos much bigger like this. Okay, then I can center it in my website. Okay, let's see how this cursor works. Click, click preview. See this cursor you see here the three dots here. It means there is three images. The people can click here to see the other images. We add only three images, as you see. This is it's called cursor images. I need everyone to do the same today whatever I show you you need to apply it in your expo website 
I'm done from preview. What else are we going to learn today? How to add a button, like this button, for example, I need to add a button. What is this button for? What is the name of this button, for example? Uh, Expo. Let me call it Dubai Expo 2020 main site. Okay, and then I can add the link here. You need to add a link. Let me go here and go to the main page of this website. I'll take this copy, go to my page, and paste it here. Then I click what? Insert. I may click already here the button and I expand it. What is this button for? Okay, let's click preview as well. This button it's like an also text link. Yeah, this button when someone click on it, it will be there is a link and it takes you to that website. A different way only of the links. Okay, how many links we did today? Text links and image links and the button links. Okay guys. I can put in this link to if different different if I'm going to create a, a different website with a different title, you can whatever add in that things links to something as you want. Okay guys. Okay, let me close the exit preview. Uh, as you see, there is many things else you can add it to your uh, website. Okay, I'm going to uh, show you the this other things inshallah later. This is that's all for today. I want to everyone uh, to make sure that you add all the things that you, I show you today. Okay, and make sure if you didn't complete your website from the previous week to add images. Sorry, to add images, text, add pages, themes, all the things that we learned it before. Okay, guys, as of today, I already done some part from my website. It means I add more things. I can click publish again to publish the updates, things that you, I can see your work in your previous submission. Okay, for this period, it means I'm not going to give you another uh, uh, another you don't need to submit again or if you didn't submit uh, before you need to go to week 6 folder to submit your website guys I give you a due date to, to due date to publish to publish and uh, copy your link publish in your assignment just I'll show you again how you publish I say click publish then after that you click on this button here click view publish sites Okay, this is the published site that you already created. Okay, this here is the home page, more info. Go to home page, for example, and take this link, copy the link, and go to your assignment in your uh, Schoology. As I showed you before, okay, you log into your account and you submit it there. Okay, guys? Okay, there is another way to copy the link of your published website you click here pop, uh, copy the published site link when you click here this is your published site link you copy the link and you can share it with anyone or you can submit it to the assignment okay guys this is all for today please finish all the things on time within 24 hours you need to finish all the things and I will check your assignment okay guys that's all for today thank you see you next week